Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to Planet Crafter. Makes me giggle every time I see it. Uh, today we are, I've uh, let a little bit of time pass, about a hundred MTI. I found a couple of chips. I went out and uh, picked up some of the boxes. Boy, that is loud. Oh, a T3 jetpack. Uh, T3. Um, explosives. We are gonna make our own. Uh, wait a minute, two, four, six, eight. Yeah, we're gonna make our own explosives. I told you I was gonna straighten up this mess. I haven't done any of the labeling. All right, there's four. We don't need that many. Um, oh, we did need two though. Two osmium and a super alloy. There we go. Oh, that was, this is just, we gotta straighten this mess out. There we go. <laughs> uh, let's see, where should I put explosives? I think I'll put it in here. I also found another oxygen multiplier. And let's see here. Oh, we got to upgrade flowers, it looks like. Uh, oh, God, that takes two explosives as well. Um, and uranium. Okay. We have a tremendous amount of cobalt. I built a uh, shredder. I think I put the extra... Um, I put in some extra... iron somewhere. I don't know where it is though. Alright, so put this here. There we go. Now we have even more oxygen. Well, that one is out of range. I never realized that. We'll just move it over and then uh, when we convert them, we'll fix that then. Uh, we have some other stuff that we need to do first. Namely, we need to get rid of all of those pressure drills. And for that, no, we don't need that much. Uh, I think that's too much. Uh, let's see, where do I want to put, I think I'll put it up here. It's kind of in my way though. What about up here? Can I attach them to the side of the hill right there? I don't know. Um, trying to decide. I think I can put it right here. Am I out of oxygen yet? So I need to take all this stuff down, but I have absolutely nowhere to store it. Uh, how many parts is that? Uh, six. How many parts do I have? Uh, five times... Is that five times four? I have 20 more. We'll just we'll try to make some sense out of this <laughs> but we need to get this going gosh you know it sure seemed like an awful lot more <laughs> I have almost two full cases of aluminum and uh, I am separating the iron as much as I can put the titanium underneath Go get the machine optimizer. Oops, let me get the fuse out first. I'll bring it up here. I don't know if I've mentioned this enough times yet, but the uh, 
the machine optimizers can now go indoors. So if you, uh, I'm just put it right there on the corner. So if you, um, if you want to put optimizers, oh dear God, on uh, your heaters, your indoor heaters, for instance. Yeah, yeah. Um, here we go. Oh boy, that was close. Um, then uh, you can just put the optimizer inside. Okay, that's three. The machine can only do five, so, and these are like uh, huge, I think. Um, so uh, these are 17 pressure, and uh, these are 459 pressure, so huge. So I don't really want to go too far, but, and we'll get all this material back. Oops. There we go. Oh, we got a pink one. <laughs> it doesn't actually make any difference, but we have a pink one, so we may as well reload it. There we go. <laughs> okay, so that's uh, 12, 1,350-something, 70, I don't know. And uh, with an optimizer on it, so pressure should be greatly improved. Uh, pressure is greatly improved and down here under pressure we have the gas extractor we'll just sit here for a second and uh, also at 750 heat we're gonna get the nuclear fusion so we're gonna up the heat too and and boom. okay uh, gas extractor. We need uh, two zeolites and iridium and three super alloys. Uh, wait. Um, there it is. Uh, oh, a rod. Okay. Rods are in here. And then super alloy. There we go. And we'll just, we always put this one outside. It doesn't matter. It's just a big machine that just can go outside. Okay, uh, how many of those uh, do I have left? I still have three of those. So we just need, I think, an explosive. Yeah, we just need an explosive. Um, now it's dark. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> no. Just one explosive. Lest I'll have to go get sulfur again right away. I think it's very funny how um, uh, all that stuff is still powered. Come on. There we go. Probably have to do that again. I'm so sick and tired of nighttime. Oh my gosh. I can't tell you. <laughs> I can't tell you how tired I am of nighttime. Uh, it's been like almost non stop nighttime constantly. Uh, we need to replace that seal light. Okay. Uh, next up is heaters. For that, we will also need explosives. How many do I want to do? So I've got these. These are 28. These are 538. I don't want to go more than five because I've got the optimizers, which also have to go outside. Uh, two rods, three alloys, and an explosive each. Uh, and I need, um, I need quite a bit of heat. So let's do at least three of those. I 
need to rebuild this base because we're going to need <laughs> we're going to need it to be rebuilt. It's, it was great for when it was little, but uh, it's not great now. Okay. Uh, no. Oh, I already can't remember. Three each. Okay, this is going to kill the power too. And then we're going to take down the other ones. I do wish that I had left more room in here. We still have the flower spreaders to do. And um, we've got comments about the locations of uh, um, star form crates. Only one of which I've actually been able to see, though. Unfortunately, um, I, I did look around a little bit, but I've only seen one of them. Oops. So the thing is, is that the um, the uh, some of these things give off both pressure and heat. So you can see we're getting that. As long as we're hitting all three pressure with the pressure, we're also grabbing a couple of those heat there. And uh, do these give off heat? No. Yeah, they do. Okay, so they give off heat as well. So when we look at these, we want to make sure that we're hitting all three of the heaters and then a couple of pressure drills. And so we get a little bit of an overlap there uh, between them. And now we can get rid of the heaters that are inside. Great. Okay. Um, a lot of extra stuff here. I'll just dump that right there. Zoom. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I've changed, fixed, moved, maneuvered that audio so many times. It's ridiculous. And it's still not... Um, it's, it's getting overwhelmed, I think. And then three waters and a super alloy. Oh my goodness. I guess I need to label things. I wasn't going to, but I guess I do need to. Alright. Let's get as close to the uh, nuclear fusion power. But um, the thing is, is that we can't really make it because we can't make pulsar quartz. And we only have a little bit of pulsar quartz. So, uh, heat and pressure are flying. Heat is up significantly. That's an extra 7,000 in heat, uh, as I remember it. Okay, so next up is the T2 drill at 364. We're almost there. And then tree spreader comes in, uh, biomass at 45. We're not doing good there. We need to change all those flower spreaders. So we need a uh, fertilizer and a super alloy to do that. Okay. We need to change this, these things as well. Because they're obviously not producing enough. Is there any hanging down low? 
because they were pretty low down the last time I picked them. Alright, that's only going to give us one fertilizer, I think. Yeah, we need to change those right away. Uh, do I have some, actually? I have two. I have some of those. One, two, three. Uh, right? And then that's it for sulfur. Oh my goodness. All right. Okay. And then super alloy. That is all of them. Now what's the uh, power difference here? Uh, 28 to 38. It's plus 10, so plus 50. We've got it. Groovy. Should probably also go get the good flowers. And, uh... Oops. What in the hell is wrong with you? Delete. Oh my god. I was doing that earlier. I was making myself so mad. And it's like, just hit the delete spot for goodness sake. Uh, yeah, let's go get the good flowers. Let me take that. And we'll rearrange that. And we'll see uh, just how many I have. So, isn't one of those? Yeah, one of them is a super flower. And then we got two. Three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. We'll put those super cool purpley pink flowers right in the middle there. Oh God, I forgot all about this. Gosh darn it. Oh, did I waste all of it? Almost. Oh, there's the extra stuff right there. Okay, so we got uh, heat pressure um, flower spreaders, these things are next. So we need a bioplastic and fertilizer. So we're going to have to wait on that because I don't have the fertilizer now. So I think what we should do is we'll go get the star form crate that I can see. And first, let me read. Um, I'm just going to step out of the game here and pull up channel comments okay and then uh, you know where that one was and then Okay, so Mike said, when I turn away from the flower spreader and I'm looking at the lake in front of the base, there's a large rock rock in the water. I mean, there's this large rock in the water. Cause I, I, oh, good. Seed spreader rocket. This can't be the rock he's talking about. Cause I've been all over this. Surely I would have seen that one. Looking towards the lake. Hmm, not too sure about that one. 
I will need something, I think, a little bit more specific. Because uh, um, I know I'm way off the mark now. What are you? Oh, zeolite. Good. I forgot all about needing more zeolite. Oh, yeah. We're way past 500 MTI. All right. Well, the other one, I know. So, it, uh, the flower spreader, turn away from the base. There's a large rock in the water. Um, this one? Uh, wait, I'm falling. <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh my god, you're a genius. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, there's another 600% multiplier. And uh, there's another one, although I'm going to grab a breath here. There's another one on top of one of the spires. And uh, that one, I just wanted to say, okay, so that was Mike, uh, Mike Richards, and uh, Redbeard uh, is the one that I got the spires from. Let me just step in there for a second, just in case I have to struggle to get up that spire. I'm going to go up here so you can see it, because you can see it from up here. There it is, right there. Up. Right there. So, let's see if I can get up that spire. There we go. <laughs> uh, very cool. Oh, there's some, fer there's all the fertilizer we needed. Fantastic. All right. And uh, something else you should notice, that not only is there mushrooms growing, I will, I will take that mushroom. There's many of them. There's also corals in, in the corals. We don't need mushrooms right now, but uh, corals in the corals. I'm gonna have to change my um, my view back to OBS, or else I'm gonna really, really mess things up. So here, let me just do this and click on OBS. All right, uh, we got the fertilizer we needed and a chip. Yes, finally. Next to, oh my god, there's a rock in, in here. Why, why did that happen? Hello? Was it, did a rock fall out of the sky? There's a rock inside my base now. <laughs> I don't know why there's a rock inside the base, I really don't. It's still there. This is not good. Um... Wow, I, I'm not really sure what to say about this, except that it's it's really not good information. Uh, oops. There's this one. Was there just an update to the game just a second ago? <laughs> no? Why? <laughs> If why is that there? <laughs> okay, so um, yeah, we need um, need bioplastic. And oops, I oops, come on now, try to be helpful there, fingers. Uh, we need uh, an extra super alloy and uh, bioplastic. Oh my gosh. I don't know if that was it. Okay, so. Oh boy. Nope. Sploosh. Did I just hurt myself splooshing into the water? I would not be surprised. need a little bit of room here uh, for building the automatic farm. There we go. Hopefully there's enough room there for uh, 
um, stuff to grow while we're messing around with this. <clears throat> uh, let's see. We need to go get the sulfur. Oh, that wasn't enough for two. Okay. And that, and that, and oops. Nope, that's sulfur. Over here is rockets. We're going to change two more, two more fire. That's not been there this whole time. And now all of a sudden it's there. I'm so confused by that. Oh, man. And this is the second night cycle since the beginning of the video. And there was one right before uh, I started, too. Uh, where did the rest of the flowers go? Oops. That's not even where they go. Oops. We gotta, um... There we go. Oh, here. This'll work. Alright, we need seal light. And... Uh, put that away. And eat. And drink. Uh oh. Um. Okay. Why is that rock inside my base? I not see through that roof at all. Not when it's green, I can't. Oh my gosh, we need to build the garden. And what was the other thing? Uh, yeah, the star form crates that are in the hills up there, I got one of them. And the ones that are down in the caves uh, below, well, we're about to hit one GTI. I was going to say we're waiting for waiting until GTI for that. Alright, let's upgrade. We need the methane. Let's take all four. Uh, and we need that seal light back. Yay! You know, I think there's... Yeah, there is. Let's grab that and put that in there. And we'll put some of the oxygen in there. So that I can keep putting that in there. And, oh, by the way, we can make super alloy rods now. I'm really happy about that. Uh, okay, so we've got oxygen. I don't think I have um, a need for another hut over there. Unless I put one on the other side. There's one, um, there's a hut between, um, oh, this needs to go out a little bit. Oh, we might do that. So there's a hut right there. And right here somewhere. Didn't I? I just put a hut here. It's, uh, there it is. It's in front of the ship. And, um, there's a hut right there. There's one on top of the mountain next to the Starform ship. And then there's a hut right there. There. Is that all of them? I think so. But uh, we'll take one, but I don't think we're going to need it. We've got just like a minute uh, to go get um, Gosh, I don't want to start a ship or anything. I think we'll just go look over here. And, uh, and there's a hut over here too. But we'll just go look over here and see if it's happened because we're at one GTI now and I fully expect that it has happened. It has. Woohoo! Oh, there's another box I missed. I keep seeing boxes I missed. Oh my god. 
Look at it. It happened. Boy, it's a good thing I moved that hut, huh? Well, I knew I needed to. I wasn't 100% sure if that little piece of bare rock was going to be good. You know. I wonder if it's open. I have a hut. I could go drop it in there. It looks like it is. Alright, so down here. I thought there was one in here. Look at that! It's so boobiful! <laughs> There's Frog Pond. I'm gonna put the, uh, the little underground hut right here. I'm gonna just grab a breath. And, uh, cause, uh, there's a frog pond. Can't wait for froggos! <laughs> there's all kinds of good stuff in here. Uh, now that I've got the chip that I've been waiting for, I'm, like, not really 100% concerned about, um, getting chips, even though we need them. So there it is. There is, uh, the boobiful Melissa tree. And there's, a uh, Melissa tree seed here and another one. And uh, when we come back next time, we're going to start gathering trees. All right, you guys, I want to thank you all so very much for coming along. I do hope that you have a lovely evening. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.